Chris, spelled with a K, on the central coast of Australia writes to me, some days my system sounds really nice, and other days it's only average. I'm wondering if it's my mood or having power conditioners where the power is dirty at certain times of the day. I currently use an Isotec Aquarius. I'm highly thinking of getting a P12 regenerator if this cure is my problem. Any help would be appreciated. Well, yeah, that's you've got it exactly right. A regenerator is going to largely fix that problem. But it's not noise on the power line that we're concerned with. If it were noise, your Isotec, which is a passive power conditioner, would fix that. Isotex, they're, they're great passive power conditioners. They clean noise and hash off of the line, but honestly, that's not all that important. Your power supply inside of your equipment does a pretty good job of that. And the longer I do this, the more I realize that the cleaning of the power of these ultrasonic stuff has a certain impact, but it's, it's not the key to having great sound all day long without interruption. Because what's happening is our power is shared. So here at PS Audio, we share, I, I don't know how many businesses around here use our power but it all comes from these utility poles. And so maybe there's a hundred businesses around here and all hundred businesses are on the same line and we're sharing it. So during the day, we can see it. I mean, if you just put it on one of our analyzers, you can see that during the day, we get an extreme phase shift. We get a, a cutoff, a flat topping, major flat topping of the AC waveform, which means of course, as, as it's charging, it doesn't get up to where we do the most good, if we remember, most power supplies charge only at the very tip uh, of the AC waveform. And that's because the, as, you, as the sine wave goes up and then starts coming down again, the capacitors in the power supply hold on to whatever power they, they, they can. And then on, as the waveform goes back up, you, you still haven't exceeded the level where you have in the caps and then all of a sudden, bam, and now that last bit is where we're taking the power from the AC and charging our caps. And that's, if you look inside of a power supply, you'll see what we call power supply ripple, which is this angular waveform that goes through. But here, and probably at your house, during the day or during the night, that amount of flat topping, that change in phase angle and all of that, that does concern how your system sounds is going to change. Now a power plant, which is an actual AC regenerator, fixes that because what comes out of the power plant is perfect AC because it's rebuilt, it's regenerated, right? That's the whole nature of it. So you get low impedance, fully regulated power with low distortion. And it's one of the reasons why a P12 and any of our larger power plants include a THD analyzer and an oscilloscope right on the front panel. I think those, yeah, I mean, do you need it? No, but it's interesting to see because while your Isotec and any passive conditioner can do nothing about any of those problems, which are the serious problems, only a power plant or only a regenerator can actually take care of those. So get yourself regenerated power and most of that is going to go away and you should have good sound 24 hours a day. All right, hope that helps.